Hello everybody and welcome to a brand new Minecraft update video with me in the little wood also known as Martin so today we are checking out Minecraft beta 1.4 uh, and the first thing you're going to notice on this today is that it's got a brand new logo and honestly I really like the new logo I think the old one used to get a little bit lost behind the you know the captions with terrestrial and stuff and I think on the page it didn't really have as much of a it, it didn't look as big as it could because this is a massive game, isn't it? You know, millions of people have bought it, but the logo didn't really give it that oomph it needed. But now the blocks are thicker. You've got a creeper inside the A as well, which is really cool. And I think it definitely stands out a lot more on the page, which is good. So we're going to go in. Last night we did a live stream uh, and I'm going to take you over to have a look because we found some wolves. We found two, um, affectionately named them Patrick. And of course, the next one would be a female. So we called it Patricia. <laughs> Um, but unfortunately, Patrick died on this very spot right here. We were fighting a spider and a skeleton. He took out the skeleton by himself. And just as I bragged about how awesome we were, he got killed by a spider. Everybody in the live stream chat were really gutted, as I was as well. Here's a picture, actually, of a little funeral that we held after. See, everybody's got their heads down. Even Link was there. That was really nice. And then, obviously, we found Patricia, and she kind of went as well. So <laughs> what we're going to do in the video today, we're first going to go and find ourselves some new wolves so I can show you about taming them and all the other bits as well. Mm. <gasps> oh, thank God. Finally, after literally about an hour of looking, some people find them really quick. Other people take forever like me. We have found ourselves a wolf. Now, I'm just going to get my sheep. This is all the facts that I've got about the wolf. So it's a passive-aggressive monster, or mob, uh, which basically means it won't start on you unless you start on him. His eyes will go red, he'll start foaming at the mouth, and the whole shebang. And they are pretty strong, so, um, you know, you're pretty brave if you want to take one out. Partly because you probably won't find any more for quite some time. Now, you can do something called taming, which is basically he becomes your pet. So you'll notice at the minute, he's not got a collar or anything on. And when I right-click on him with some bones he will get a collar and he'll instantly become my pet so here we go okay so see that black smoke that meant it didn't work when it does work you get um some red love hearts that appear above his head just like that and ah oh, we got ourselves a nice little wolf we're gonna name him patrick affectionately after last night's oh my god this too this patricia that is so, so cool. So these guys will basically attack anything. Um, I don't know how to... There we go. If you right-click on the middle of their body, it gets them out of the sitting position. So myself, Patrick, and Patricia are going to go find some uh, monsters or maybe some pigs, and we're going to kill them. So what they do is, when you punch a pig or a cow or anything like that, um, the, the wolves and the dogs, or whatever you want to call them, will go to work on them and absolutely destroy them in a matter of seconds. They won't, however, they won't go after creepers, which is really, really cool. Um, so yeah, you don't need to worry about that. But, another weird thing, they will kill you if you're trying to kill yourself. So the only way I can imagine you can do that is if you shoot an arrow directly upwards and it hits you. When you take dogs into water and they come out, they do this really nice animation. So, where are they? There's Patrick. Where's Patricia at? Hmm, I don't know. That's okay. Ready? Watch this. Oh, Patrick, come over here. Patrick! Over here, boy. Come on. Come on. Right, shake yourself off a little bit if you can, please. There we go. <laughs> How cool is that? Oh, you might have just seen that there, actually. Did you see that? how Patricia came all the way forward. So basically, when wolves are too far away from you, they'll actually teleport. We had something similar on the live stream last night where we actually managed to... Um uh, where, we, where I went down into a cave but because wolves can't go through doors either uh, they can actually teleport in with you if you go too far now are they both here? here they are so if I attack that both of them will go to work on it and take out the pig straight away and I've also found as well if you have wolves attack stuff for you you seem to get more uh, materials from it you tend to get more pork you tend to get more leather I don't know if that's a fact I don't know if that means anything but I, that's just what I found from experience right okay so there we go so that oh no 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 Patrick careful be very careful Patrick. oh goodness me okay so apparently you can indicate how much health they've got depending on how high their tail is now see how this one here is completely level with the body whereas this one is raised ever ever so slightly so 
if I can, I'm going to give you some food just to heal you a little bit. Come over here. Here we go. There's one. See how his tail's now back up into the sky? Let's do it one more time. There we go. You're sat down. Do you want to sit down as well? Thank you very much. Right, you sit there for a moment. Right, so now we're going to test out something else. We're going to test out the new bed spawning system. So my spawn is just a tiny bit away from here. I've got myself a little house. I'm going to make it into night time. So, time set, 15k. There we go. So it's nice and dark. My dogs are still alive and we are going to go to sleep. So hopefully this will reset my spawn point. It's not 100%. I think it's, um, I don't know if it's a glitch that it's not 100% or if it's done on purpose. So that's my spawn point over there. And this is my house. So if I kill myself and respawn, I will respawn down here. See, it didn't work. We're going to give it another go and see what happens. Okay, we're going to have one more go. Third time lucky, hopefully. So we go to sleep. Then it's daytime. Then we're going to kill ourselves. And will we land next to the clay or will we land in the house? Here we go. I'm falling. Lots of falling. And no, I'm over by the clay again. Maybe I'm not far away enough from the spawn. Maybe that could be it, but I don't think it is. Never mind. Okay, so one of the last things I've got to show you on the updates is this. So you can now make cookies, which is really cool. So if you're lucky enough to find some um, cocoa beans, this egg will represent the cocoa beans for now. You only find them in dungeons at the minute. Uh, but if you find them, you can dye wool brown, you can make cookies. And I think that is about it at the minute. So the recipe is cocoa beans in the middle and wheat either side. And that will give you a stack of eight cookies. That's how many it gives to you once you've done it. And these cookies only restore half health, as in half a heart. But me and Max were talking about it, and we were saying it was quite good because sometimes you'll fall down a massive ledge, you'll maybe only lose, I don't know, one and a half hearts, and you don't really want to waste an entire pork chop on it. But then you're also left with the risk of that you've got less health if something comes at you. So if I jump down here, there goes a heart, there's half a heart, there's a full heart. Now, my only problem with this is that the number of people wearing the Cookie Monster skin on multiplayer four on multiplayer servers is going to go up a lot. And it is going to be very, very annoying. It's not going to be good. Okay, so now we've looked at all the good stuff, why don't we have a quick look at some of the errors that have already been flagged up with the new Minecraft version. So, basically, you find coding is always really awkward. You'll do one thing right and then something else will go completely wrong. Uh, nothing too serious in this update, just a couple of bits, particularly with things underwater. You can now put ladders down underwater anywhere at all, which is quite interesting. You can put sugar canes wherever you want underwater which is also a little bit weird. Uh, and you can also put cactuses down. Now before, um, you apparently you couldn't put cactuses underwater, but you could put them on sand and that was it. But apparently now, you can put them on mud. And I don't know if this applies to above the water as well. Let's have a quick check. Um, let's break this block away. Pop it back down as mud and try the cactus. Okay, so now mud only works with a cactus underwater. It doesn't happen over the water. Okay, that makes sense. That's pretty cool. And there we go. I think that is everything for the update. Beta 1.4 is now out. I imagine Beta 1.401 will come out in the next couple of days when they update some of the bugs and fix everything. Uh, so yeah, we've looked at the good, the bad. These two aren't ugly at all. They're just little cuties. Oh, would you like a cookie? No, nope. sit down. Stay there. And you can have one as well. And you can sit down. There we go. Uh, so yeah, thank you very much for watching. We're going to do another live stream tonight on livestream.com forward slash in the little wood. Starting roughly between 7 and 8 p.m. GMT time. Links are in the description to my Twitter and the website. And I'll probably post a video again saying, I'm on. Come and watch me play Minecraft. Yay. So the plan is we're going to do some Zelda episode 8 doing that live. Hopefully get a lefty and righty competition going in during that, which will be cool. And then straight after that, the stream is going to continue we're all going to jump on a multiplayer server and have a good old time so i shall see you hopefully a little later on bye <laughs> wrestlemania is next week oh lefty run. Need to put right in the comments